Hello, my name's Phil and I work for the Consumer Services Department at the Hoselock Head Office in Birmingham. With over 50 years horticultural expertise, we at Hoselock understand the rewards of gardening and want to help you to get the best from your garden. Okay, from time to time, uh, especially when setting up a micro-irrigation system, you'll need to measure the flow rate of water from your garden tap. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to do that. Um, to do it, you'll need a container of a known volume, preferably in litres. It's better if you get something that's got graduated marks so that you can see exactly how much uh, the vessel holds. And you'll also need a stopwatch, I'm going to use my wristwatch, to time the number of seconds it will take to fill that container. So the first thing we need to do is to turn our tap on and fill the container up to the maximum mark and time the number of seconds that it takes to do that. That will give us um, a figure that we can work with and that will allow, allow us to calculate the flow rate in litres per hour. So we'll go ahead now and fill the bucket and time the number of seconds. Now in our particular example the bucket holds 12 litres of fluid and when filling the bucket up it took 25 seconds. So with that information we can now calculate the flow rate in litres per hour. To do that we divide the number of seconds into 3600 and if you divide 3600 by 25 seconds that comes to a figure of 144. In your case it may be a different uh, n number of seconds depending on the volume of the container that you're using. We now multiply 144 by the number of litres in the container. In our case that was 12 litres. So multiplying that together we get the figure of 1728 and therefore 1728 litres per hour is the flow rate of water from our tap. That's the information that we'll need when setting up our micro system. That's it, job done.